Against the tuition hikes! Against, against the tuition hikes! Against, 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 against all of the things! Against all of the things! That are making it possible! That are making it possible! For us not to be in school! For us not to be in school! Working two jobs! Working two jobs! Or three jobs! Or three jobs! Three jobs. Or three jobs. Or taking out massive loans! Taking out massive loans! In order to! In order to! Graduate! Graduate! With the hope! With the hope! Of getting a job! Of getting a job!
We are gonna be shit out of luck. We are gonna be shit out of luck. It's gonna be too late. It's gonna be too late. We won't be able to change anything. We won't be able to change anything. Look left. So look left. Look left. Look left. Look right. Look right. Look right. Look right. We're all different. We're all different. But we have one thing in common. But we have one thing in common. Struggle. 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 Power to the people. Power to the people. Mic check. Mic check. Mic check. Mic check. Can we ask our state? When we ask our state? Can we ask our government? Can we ask our government? Why can't you afford our tuition? Why can't you afford our tuition? Why can't you afford health care? Why can't you afford health care? We can afford the streets. We can afford the streets. We can afford the war. We can afford the war. We can afford the prisons. We can afford the prisons. Well, I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why. This isn't the answer they're going to tell you. This isn't the answer they're going to tell you. For 2012, the Department of Defense has been allocated $707.5 billion. Has been allocated $707.5 And that's just one on the list of 10 military budgets. Do you want to know the whopping cost? Do you, Do you want, want to know the whopping cost? Do you want to know where our deficit's at? Do you want to know where our deficit's at? I'm taking a guess. I'm taking a guess. But I'm going to say it's in the $1.415 trillion. What I'm going to say is $1.415 trillion. That our nation is going to spend this year, just this year, that our nation is going to spend just this year, on our military. On our military. And so when our hospitals are falling apart, so when our hospitals are falling apart, and our poverty rates have never been higher in 30 years, and our poverty rates have never been higher in 30 years, and your tuition goes up, and your tuition goes up, and they cut hope, and they cut hope, and they determine who can get education, and they determine who can get education, and they cut teachers' pensions, and they cut teachers' pensions, and then they tell you that there's no money. And then they tell you that there's no money. I hope that we have the strength to stand up. I hope that we have the strength to stand up. Look them in the face. Look them in the face. And let them know we know they're lying. And let them know we know they're lying. There is money. There is money. It's our money. It's our money. And it's time that we spend it on us. And it's time that we spend it on us. On our education. On our education. And on our children's education. On our children's education. We can collectively pay for soldiers. Yeah, we, we can collectively pay for soldiers. To hold guns in someone else's country. To hold guns in someone else's country. Why can't we pay teachers to hold books in ours? Why can't we pay teachers to hold books in ours? Why can't soldiers who are engineers? Why can't soldiers who are engineers deal with the homelessness problem in the states? Deal with the homelessness problem in the states. Why can't our soldiers be working towards green energy? Why can't our soldiers be working towards green energy? I think these are some good questions. I think these are some good questions. That our government needs to be asked. That our government needs to be asked. And we need to make these questions loud. And we need to make these questions loud. We can pull back our nation for ourselves.